An orofacial cleft is a gap in the lip, upper jaw, and all the palate. The medical term is schisis, which means opening in Greek. About one or two of every one thousand babies are born with a cleft. There are different types of clefts: a cleft in the upper lip only, a cleft in the palate only, a cleft in the upper lip as well as in the palate. During pregnancy, the upper lip and the palate develop separately on the sides of the head. While the baby develops, these tissues grow towards each other and join up in the middle. In the case of an orofacial cleft, a gap forms because these tissues don't join up. It's not exactly known why this fusion doesn't take place. Genetic factors may play a part in it. A child with an orofacial cleft may have several problems. In case of a palate cleft, the complaints are often more serious than with a lip cleft. Most problems occur because the mouth and the nose are connected to each other by the gap. A few examples are difficulties with drinking, speech defects, more susceptible to colds, frequent ear infections. Orofacial clefts are fixed by means of surgery. Surgery to repair a cleft in the upper lip can already be done by the age of three months. Surgery to repair a cleft palate often takes place when the child is between six and fifteen months old. A team of doctors and specialists called a schisis team works together to treat an orofacial cleft. For example, besides an oral surgeon and plastic surgeon who perform the surgery, there is a speech therapist who counsels a child and an orthodontist who straightens the teeth. A child with a cleft will have regular dentist checkups till it reaches adulthood. Because children with orofacial clefts are more prone to ear infections, often an otolaryngologist is also part of the team. To get the best results, a surgery is sometimes needed at an adult age. People around may have different responses to a child with an orofacial cleft. Sometimes this can be difficult for the child as well as the parents. It often helps to explain what's going on and be open about it. A psychologist might be of help with this.